Hi vlog! I don't know when the last time was that we talked, but as you can see, my entire closet is set up. I don't know if I have released that video. If not, then it'll be coming soon after this one. I wanted to do like a day in my life vlog. We're gonna go to Whole Foods and then I'm gonna come back to my house, drop off my groceries, and then I'm gonna go meet my mom and my sister and my sister-in-law to go get our toes done. My mom and I might go shopping before as well. It just depends on how long I need to run my errands. Um, but I'm super excited for today. I think it's gonna be a fun day and I'm excited to bring you along with me. I just did my makeup on TikTok Live, which was super fun. I guess I could show you over here in the natural light so you can kind of see a little bit better. But yeah, I've been loving going live on TikTok and doing my makeup, so <laughs> it's super fun. This is the look for today. I did, like, I've been loving fake freckles recently, which is funny because I always hated fake freckles and now I'm like on the fake freckle train, like, I get it. So let's get, I actually just bought some new Adidas sneakers. I had the black Sambas, but I wanted to get the white for summer. So I haven't even worn these yet. So today's going to be the first day, but I just was like, want, I haven't been wanting them for so long. And I was like, I feel like I'll get so much use out of these. I ended up changing my entire outfit because I hated my entire outfit. So I changed my hair, my shirt my pants and my shoes okay i don't know if this is just me but does anybody else hate the adidas sambas i don't know if i've ever put on such an uncomfortable shoe and i'm like what is up with me just got off the phone with my mom and i'm going to meet her at two it's currently one o'clock so i'm just gonna run get raw milk get some groceries and then hopefully it's to hold my phone so it doesn't fall because it's like literally balancing on my phone tripod right now because i don't have a car tripod yet we're working on it i actually just ordered one i just need to set it up in my car speaking of cars so my husband colby and i are looking at getting a new car we're probably gonna pull the trigger this summer we've like been doing a bunch of research and stuff we have our eye on a few different like car brands and makes and stuff i've actually always just wanted a range rover but apparently range rovers are like the number one targeted car for like theft and they have tons of issues with just like the maintenance and i'm just not about that i currently drive a hyundai tucson and we got it in 2020 and we love it it's like been such a good car but we're definitely ready for a little bit of an upgrade and i'm really excited about it so we're looking at like some luxury suvs that's like the best way to describe what we're looking for we're looking at porsche cayenne the porsche macan BMW X3, BMW X5, and the BMW X6. I've always loved Tesla as well, but I don't love the interior of Teslas. I think they're like too, they're too like modern technology for me. I want something that's like a little bit more, I hate the word like old school, but I can't think of a better way to describe a car that I actually want other than that. I like how like the Porsche, for example, has a little like clock in the middle of the dash in the front. So um, and I really like the Porsche Macan and the Porsche Cayenne. To me, they're like basically the same. I think the, the Cayenne's just a little bit bigger. You guys, I literally charged my battery on my vlog camera. But of course, because I'm a noob with vlogging, so the rest of the clips are probably not gonna be as good of quality, but I'm still gonna take you throughout my day, pick up some raw milk, all that good stuff. So anyways, if you have any feedback on any of those cars, then let me know. My favorite Range Rover is the Range Rover Sport. But yeah, I don't think that will go with Range Rover just for the reasons that I mentioned. Let's go pick up this raw milk. Hi. Hi. Good, how are you? Good, thank you. Um, when does your guys' current milk that you have expire? Um, so, sell by date is the 24th. Okay. And it's good five to seven days after that. So okay. Okay, let's do, let me look. Let's do a gallon and a half. Can I also get um, an Abigail sourdough? Thank you. Um, let's do yeah. Let's do the country, and then do you guys have any like lunch items? Um, we are out of our chicken salad. Okay. 
one. That's like that's like one thing. Oh, you're good. I'm gonna just see if there's anything else yeah. that I want to try. Yeah. Okay. Maybe I'll try one of your cookies. Yeah. I'll just try one of these oatmeal chocolate chip ones. They, I've always wanted to try one, so I'm like, it's a good day. Do you guys have any of the small milks? Other the kinds? Yeah, can I get yeah. one of those too? I'm like, I gotta have the milk with the cookie. It's, the best. it's so good. I love that. Yes, it's the best. Okay, I think that should be good for both of those. Thank you. I got my raw milk and they had these like, I'm gluten free now because of Hashimoto's. That's another life update. But I really want to try this oatmeal chocolate chip gluten free cookie. Mm. I got a gallon and a half of my raw milk and then I got a little mini one to eat. With my cookie, you guys, I get so much hate. It's like insane for drinking raw milk. I don't know if I've ever received so much hate on my, like, four years of being on the internet. You guys, it's like the biggest life hack. And it's changed my life. I've been drinking it too for two years. I thought I was like intolerant to dairy before I had raw milk. Turns out, just allergic to pasteurized milk because it doesn't have the enzymes that helps your body break it down. But make sure whoever, if you do try raw milk, just make sure you get it from a good farm. My camera died, but why does this look better than my freaking camera? The lighting is so good. Um, one thing I'm excited about for a new car, a sunroof, because this is so dumb and first world problems, I know. Like, I get it. It's stupid. But when it comes to filming, it is my job. And my lighting sucks in my car without having this. It's actually pretty good right now because it's the middle of the day. But I just got to my parents' house. I actually want, I went to, what's it called? Jersey Mike's to get Colby a sandwich. And then I got myself there. Italian like the mini sub that's like on the gluten-free bread. It was actually pretty good I feel like the Italian made the gluten-free bread soggy. I know that probably sounds so gross, but it made it taste better than If it would have just been regular schmegular Gluten-free bread. My mom and I are gonna go over to Target and then like I mentioned we are all gonna go get our toes done together Which I'm super excited about so I got the raw milk dropped it off at home put everything away and then now I just got to my mom's house. I'm really happy I ate because now I'm not going to... I hate being hungry, when, especially like when you're getting your toes done. I can't explain it, but like the smell of the nail salon like makes you sick. I actually hate nail salons. I only go there to get my toes done. I do my own gel nails. I'm hiding my thumb because I just did gel for the first time on Sunday. And I didn't have... I only had like this mini curing lamp to cure the gel. So I feel like it just didn't do a super good job but I'm hoping on the next time around I bought a new light that's supposed to be like the best one so hopefully that'll make them last longer and not peel off because I think my issue was too many layers of gel and then it was also um my light honestly just sucked for curing them so anyways but let's go to Target with my mom okay my mom and I have been in Target oh wait can we run to the house stuff one more time we are, I'll show you guys what I have in my cart. I got some house stuff. I want to take a peek at like the wash box. I got this lamp. I actually already have one of these. So I got another one to match for the guest bedroom. And then all this stuff is like either for my car pack or just like restocks for my house. And then let's see if they have any cute. I wanted to get like one of those little cake stands. I actually had that one in my cart. But I want to get a dark color, so I love shopping at Target. It's so much fun. Look at these like little mini Stanleys. Look at this Stanley. <laughs> what the heck? It's like a. It's a little. Oh, it's a pitcher. That's kind of fun for summer if you're doing like a picnic. I, I more romanticize the idea of a picnic than actually doing a picnic. 
but that's that is really fun though I just like looking at the kitchen stuff because it's so fun to see what they have. What is this? I just need to smell. It's mom. It's girl. It's the Girl Scout body wash that we saw, and I gotta smell it. Wait, no, this is shampoo. Oh my gosh! <laughs> it's so gross. Wait, you gotta smell it. Just smell it, just to know it. It smells like thin mints. I would not put that on my it hair. It smells like no. thin mints mixed with alcohol, though. It's like disgusting. I don't know who would buy that. No one's buying it. That's why it's still stocked up on the shelves. Like, I love Native, but that is not the vibe. Mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. You know all the TikToks, so I want to try it out. This is super thin mints. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's really good. Oh, my gosh. 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 Oh, my Touchland, trying her again. I'm so excited about that board. It's gonna be so cute. Yeah, it'll be so cute. 169.53. Yes. We're gonna get a little drinkity drink. I'm gonna get the. I'm gonna do the strawberry refresher. And then, mom, what are you gonna get? Probably the mango dragon fruit lemonade. That sounds good. I look like your mom because I'm so much taller than you. Yes, you do. <laughs> when I'm with Kelly, I also look like her mom. Kelly's my birth mom. This is my mom, and Kelly's my birth mom, and I am taller than both of you. You guys are actually probably about the same. Similar. No, she's height. shorter. She's shorter than, than you. Yeah. How tall are you? Five four. Five, five foot. Five five. Five five. Wow. I'm like five eight five nine, so I'm a tall girly. Can I do a? Can I do a medium strawberry acai refresher? Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Can I do the acai refresher? Yes. And then the last one. Can we just get the caramel let me frappuccino? Let me call her first. No, I already did. I already, it'll be cute because she'll be surprised. Because okay. Justin told me your favorite. Okay. Let's just do a caramel frappuccino. It's uh, and a medium too. You got the Starbucks. They gave me the wrong drink by accident, but it's so good. Is it mango passion fruit one? Yeah. Or no, it's dragon fruit. Yeah, mango dragon fruit. It's a lemonade and it's really good. All three of us got it and then Paige got a um, caramel frappuccino and I was gonna get the strawberry acai refresher because that's normally what I love. This is really good. It's good lemonade. And it's gonna be nice so there's no caffeine in here because What do you say we go grocery shopping together? My main goal when I go grocery shopping is to pick out whole foods. So I always start in the produce section. I'll I usually grab whatever fruit is in season and lemons and limes are something I find myself needing basically every single day when I'm cooking. I picked up some grass-fed and grass-finished ground beef, some turkey meat for my husband. I love this Greek yogurt. It is so good. I always have a list on my phone, by the way, like on my notes app that I go back and forth between when I'm in the grocery store so that I don't forget anything because it is the worst thing ever when you forget stuff at the grocery yeah, store hard time digesting dairy and you don't want to try raw milk a2 milk is awesome i eat so many eggs every day between like four to six so i always get this massive thing of eggs maple syrup is my absolute favorite thing to sweeten my matcha with we ended up only spending 130 dollars on all these foods so i'd say we did pretty good